Hello, Miss Bell. Hello, little girl Bell. Yeah, this little girl has been having some issues with her feed bucket. Yeah, she keeps knocking it over and flipping it around and pulling it off the post and all kinds of fun stuff. So, I'm going to try something. They had a corner feeder in the barn, wasn't being used, so I'm going to try putting this on. Um, I've got some 2x4s in here that haven't been used. So I'm hoping I got enough, I think I do, to install it. And uh, we'll just uh, have to see how this goes. Uh, I like to have something to fasten it with that um, I can easily remove it. So I don't know, I have to figure this one out. Um, but it looks like this is about the width of a 2x4. So we'll see. I may have to go and take a run to the hardware store. Yeah, we'll see. Oh, a little out of focus there, but all right. I filled it with water. I hosed it down. And I filled it with water because there's some crud in the bottom. I figured let it soak while I do everything else, so that you know it'll be easier to scrub it out. So it wasn't too bad, but still. All right. I right, dig out some two by fours. Oh, I forgot to turn the camera on for the first cut.
make it a little less than 15 and a half. That's okay. I got, I got some play there. Okay. Everything's full of cobwebs. Put in the marker. That's all right. Okay, let's see how this works. Oh, I got uh, these two boards. Okay. And I want them butted up against each other like that. Just so I can put them together. Now I'm going to countersink this because uh, I've only got two inch screws instead of two and a half inch. So I got to countersink this. So I need to get a bit of bit.
just gonna put it on the right gear. Man, it's been a while since I used this. Probably didn't really need to do this, but I gotta line up the holes and I figured this would be easier. So in there because there's ridges. Okay. Alright. That's alright. It'll do. I wonder if I should hang it first and then drill the hole. Well, <laughs> the thing is if I hang it first uh, you know what? I think I'd prefer the longer screws for hanging it. I think I'm going to have to go to the hardware store. So, that's it for now. Well, I decided to drill the, these holes first. So, hmm.
You know what? If only I could get the carpenter bees trained to put the holes where I want them. That's about the sizes I've seen some of the carpenter bees make. Unfortunately, they're not very cooperative. She's hot. Yeah, these babies get hot. more to do. Well, I'll be back to you when it's done. Well, I just got back. I got lots of hardware. Let's see here. I got four long bolts. Right? I got some longer screws. Oh, let me get you in. Where are you? Find the, there you go. Right, let longer screws. I got some washers. I got some lock washers and some nuts. That should do us. Now I got to get this thing put together. Oh, another thing I got. Go away, bug. I got two of these. And they're for hanging up bridles and lead ropes. All right, so hang those up after we get the corner feeder up. Feels feels good to be doing a project. All right, people, there it is. See if I can do this without a horse trying to be a camera person. Stay there, Bill. Okay. These two bolts have nuts holding them on. These two in the back, I can't get my hand up there or a wrench. Bell, leave the camera alone. So they don't have nuts on yet, but 
if nothing else acts as a pin, they're not going to go anywhere anytime soon anyway. So it's done. And of course, somebody had to be in my face. Say hello, Belle. Yeah, she's got to be nosy. Yes, hello. You know, you're not supposed to be up close to the camera like that. People can see you better when you back up when you're not so close to the camera. Yes, uh-huh, I know, you're nosy. Okay, is that what you want? You want to check it out? Well, it looks like it's the right height. She says, but there's nothing in it. <laughs> Major disappointment, huh? Yeah, I know. <laughs> Alrighty. Well, that, that worked out pretty good. Uh, we'll see how it goes. Alright. Say bye, honey. Say bye, Belle. Well, there's Belle enjoying her breakfast at her new feeder. Yeah, I think she's adjusting all right. She was a little bit prancy to begin with, but she's doing okay with it. Uh, this is the one we were mainly concerned about because she is the lead mare. And uh, she could, if she figured it out, back herself in there and double barrel this little girl. But uh, she hasn't figured out she can do that. So I want to get rid of these uh, these ropes and knots and stuff. And you know me, I hate I can't stand having things tied. Never mind, Molly. So the thing about doing is putting her tie just above the gate on this post, so I can tie her to that. I'll still have to hook her her bucket over here because we got to be able to open and close this gate. So, but uh, he has to have her within sight or he won't eat. So, that's our main concern because he's been skinny and we've been trying all different things to get him to eat. And it's like if he's worried about her, he won't eat. He's got to be calm and, and relaxed in order to eat, okay? It's just the way he is. So, I gotta make sure that she, that he can see her. That he knows that she's close by. So, so we're, I'm still trying to figure this one out. And then I wanna move Honey, where she has some shade. And I don't know if I'm going to make anything special for Libby or not because she's supposedly only here temporarily till her training's done. So I'm not sure how I'm gonna handle Libby. It would be nice if we could have the, all the horses kind of centrally located for feeding so we don't have to walk all the way up the other end. But, you know, when you've got other horses you've got to deal with. Now if I had another corner feeder, I could put one in for him and put him back in the corner and then I could put honey possibly up here on the outside. But I don't know yet. So I gotta see if there's another corner feeder. I think he'd do better with a corner feeder too. I honestly think he would. And that's just my opinion. So I'll discuss it with his owner, see what she wants to do, because it's like I can't buy all the hardware. So, but this is working out quite well. I'm quite pleased with it.